Good afternoon, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This is your 1 p.m. update. And currently, we have all the U.S. indices that we track. Trading the upside, it is a sea of green. The Dow is up 602. That's at 2%. 2 and 6 tenths for the S&P 500, 96 points. NASDAQ, 2 and 9 tenths, or 324 points. Russell's up 2.5. That's 42 points to the upside. 3 and 3 tenths for the Sox. Semiconductor, <coughs> excuse me, that's 86 points to the upside. Gold's off two dollars and sixty cents, trading out at eighteen thirty-eight. Silver's trading up fifteen pennies at twenty-one seventy-four. Lights we crude up about fifty, trading at one eleven oh five. Natural gas back ten cents. Thirty Treasury down one full point and three ticks. She's trading at one thirty-three eighteen. Let's go try to make hay out of what all this means out here. As we begin by take a look at our nine-panel market update chart, we've got the ES mini in the upper left-hand side. You're going to see that a new daily profile has formed. It is bullish in structure. Price right now is above the center of that profile. That's at 37.40. A close above 37.40 is a pretty good indication that what the S&P wants to do, or the S mini, I should say, wants to move up to the top of that profile. And that's at 38.41. If we take a look at the spot volatility, still above its 50-day exponential moving average, but headed lower and likely headed to that 50-day, which is at 27.96. The NQ... I was trading right up into the top of its daily profile. It's 11.716. The U.S. dollar index, which has a Rhodes momentum indicator top, simply has found support and been consolidating with inside its daily profile. That's between the range of 103.62 and 105.56. If we take a look at Goldilocks, really just consolidating with inside that daily profile between 18.13 and 18.79. The case with silver, this is this is this is the kind of the. Uh, the uh, silver has the last couple of days, not not uh, Friday, but on Thursday and Wednesday, and then today continues to find resistance at a spot where it says it's just a counter trend move to the upside. And that's at the center of its uh, daily profile, which is 2187. So it bears watching. Lights Recruit is trading now below the bottom of its daily profile. but And I believe uh, just a bit lower, we'll get back to its TD9 count breakout support. I'm sure we'll look at that during the Trader's Ed Show. Natural gas out here, brand new daily profile that has formed with support at $6.79. Let me make sure that's correct. $6.79? Uh, $6.79. It is. And the 30-year Treasury found resistance at the bottom of that daily profile. That profile had formed above price which is a bearish overall message. Folks, stay tuned for the Trader's Edge Show, but if you're off to start your Tuesday, have a terrific one. Thanks so much for joining us.